Hello, my saying this is Sickly Vindictum, and we're back with Subnautica. But today, I want to do something special. Uh, I'm not saying it hasn't been done before, but it's not normally what I do. I don't usually play games to do like challenges or certain things. But today, I want to do something I'm going to call Captain Jack Sparrow in this bitch. We're going to go to the void, and we are going to go right through it, go as fast as we can, and see how long it takes us to die. Now this is not a creative mode, this is actually um, freedom mode, the one I've been playing. So let me save, even though I just started a game. I don't need to save, but yeah. So we're going to save, we're going to go to the void, and I go to at world's end, see if we make it. Alright, which was the void actually? Okay, that's the aurora. So, this way, it's going to take us a while though, but we're still going to do it. I hope it gets daytime by the time we get there, because I would rather do it during the daytime. Only because I like to see the beautiful blue color that the void is. Because as dangerous as the void is, it has a very beautiful blue color to it during the day. Kind of a deceptive and luring. And since Subnaka decided to take away the feature that lets me see what biome I'm in, I won't know until I see absolute darkness or I don't know. Let's go into war a little bit. We're cool. Yeah. I thought about doing this in creative mode and using a cyclops or something. Or actually just this, but is that a, is that an island? Oh, to, oh we gotta go we gotta go underneath this boys. Oh. I have the light, I can still barely see what okay, I can't do this. Hold on. I thought if I go like below the island I could make it, but I don't. Even, I can't even see where I'm going. So let's go around the island. Wait, hold on. Never mind. We got this. Let's just go under. There we go. God, that's terrifying. Jesus. Okay, let's just go under. We're gonna come back up the other side. Not a big deal. We'll be alright. We'll be alright. Oh, look how beautiful that is. And even though Subnautica has officially launched on Xbox One, I still encounter a lot of bugs. Like, some things don't load in properly. So, I don't know if that's because I haven't bought the disc. Because um, what I, have, I paid 20 bucks to try the early access one on here. And it just updated, so I figured it updated correctly. I, I guess I gotta buy the, the disc to make it do it. But yeah, this, this version I've been using still has a lot of bugs. It's very frustrating. You know, I don't even know if I'm in the void yet. I might be. Wait, no, I would've been attacked by now. One of my favorite things to do when I was in creative mode, I used to be, um, was I would take my Cyclops and go to the void, and then I would drop down in my, um, my prawn, and I would just sink to the bottom until it would respawn me, um, in the middle of the map. Like, where the shallows are. Okay, I don't know if we're in the void yet. But I hear things. Things no man should hear. So it's very possible that we are indeed in the void. See, I don't like those noises that's happening right now. Okay, I think we're, I think we're good, actually. We would have been attacked by now, I think. I'm not going to try stopping yet. I mean, it's, it's too late to do that. Just in case we are in the void, if we stop. Okay, I think we're, yeah, we're def, we're in the void. Oh, sh oh shit, took a bite at me. Uh, how are we doing? Is that our health? 58%? Alright, let's keep going, let's keep going, see if we can survive. I heard his teeth chomp. That was weird. Okay, we alright, we cool. Okay, we're, we're in the void. Definitely. That's already been discovered. Because that ghost leviathan, th that gave it away. Okay, they're not following us. Um, they're probably following us, but I don't hear them anymore. There's no way it was this easy. Like, I wanted to outrun them and go past them. And just keep going and going and going until I couldn't anymore. Uh, but I didn't expect it to actually work. So I don't think it, that's, I don't think that's what happened. They're probably still behind me, but I'm not stopping. 
I don't hear them though. I should hear them. Let me turn off my light. Maybe that'll help me. Like, well, not hear them, but maybe they'll leave me alone. If they don't have a light. Hey, it's daytime! Nighttime? Actually, I did that backwards. My bad. Okay, if that was the void, how come it's not blue? It's daytime. I should see a blue color to the... I should see a blue color, shouldn't I? Wait, no. It's, it's getting kind of blue, I think. No, it's, it still looks more green. Okay, I'm supposed to be in the void, but I'm not... No, nah, it can't be that easy. No, I just don't believe it. Like, they tried to bite me once, and that was it. Like, I feel like they're behind me, but I am so scared to turn around right now. We're, we're, okay. Let's get more blue. Let's get more bluish. If I was a real man, I'd stop and repair my, uh, Seamoth. But <laughs> I, I am not a real man. No, I am not. I'm a fake. I'm actually a woman in drag. Which is a very hideous woman. Going down a little bit. Too far. You know, I still don't believe it. I don't believe we're in the clear at all. No. I am not letting this false sense of security get to me. We are not in the clear. We're still in the void. The fact that one of them tried to bite me and that's all they tried to do and fail. I don't believe that for one second. Nope. They are probably behind me. But I am not stopping. I am not going to turn around. I will say, let's go deeper. Yeah. Because the whole point of the Ghost Leviathans is to deter players from going outside the map. I am in freedom mode, which means I am mortal. I am vulnerable. So for that Ghost Leviathan to do nothing but just try to bite me once, I think he got my Seamoth actually, because I'm 58% life now. And that's it? That doesn't really make any sense? I thought they would hound you and chase you until they actually killed you. I really want to turn around. I really want to turn around and see if they're behind me. I wonder if you go a certain, like, far enough away where you just respawn in the middle of the map. I don't hear them, though. I would hear them. I am both perplexed and very terrified. The great blue. No, sorry. The big blue. What's it like? Big and blue. I didn't do it. This is very confusing. We're in the void, but there's no sign of the ghost of Iathans. And I know the sea moth is not fast enough to outrun them. I expected to die very quickly, but I have not died. And honestly, I don't know where to go with this video now. <laughs> I guess if I reach 15 minutes and I'm still alive, I'll just quit. I was actually anticipating dying. I just thought it would be funny to try. Alright, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to turn around just a little bit so I can, I can see if they're behind me. So scared. So scared. We are far away. Yikes. Alright, let's keep going. Like, no joke. That made my heart race just turn around. This game is terrifying. Let's go deeper. Maybe they're hiding beneath. That is... That is actually... Wait, maybe I turn my light, they'll find me. Maybe. 
I mean, that's why I turned it off to begin with. Wait, that turned me around. That turned me around. Fuck. Are you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna stop. Turn my light. You know, I think it might be more terrifying waiting for them to show up. I don't hear anything, though. Let's look down a little bit. A little bit down. Where are they? Oh, the particles are scary. This is definitely more frightening than actually facing them. Because I don't know where they are now. <laughs> I don't think you can reach a certain point where they'll stop chasing you, though. So the fact that they're disappeared makes no sense to me whatsoever. I'm going to turn around again. See if they're behind me. No, they're not. We are seven, hold on, six, nearly 7,000 meters away from the, from our life pod. This is the furthest I've ever been away. We're, we're in the void. Let's go to see if we can get to 10,000 meters. I think you go as fast backwards as you do forwards, which is good. I think one day I'll just take the time to spend like two hours just trying to travel away from the, like, past the void. Ugh, that's terrifying. Oh, wait, I turned myself around. Where am I? Oh, there I am. Okay. Let's go under while we do this. Maybe they're deeper. I don't know. I have the sudden urge to scream for my mother. Turn off that, uh, wait, was the light? Okay, it was off anyway. Okay, I'm not going to make it to 10,000 meters by 15 minutes. So I'm going to stop here. Wait a little bit again. And they're not coming. At all. Very, uh, very scary. So, to end this video, I'm just going to sink. Oh, wrong way. I'm just going to sink past my, uh, my capacity for my, uh, pressure. Until my sea moth gets completely destroyed, and I'm gonna just end this game with me floating down at the bottom of the deep. This should be fun. It's really black now. Very scary. Maximum depth reached. Damage. I know what I'm about. Here we go. It's getting destroyed. It's really black now. Any second now. And I'm just going to wait for me to lose oxygen. I don't understand where they went. Like, the fact that I can't see them terrifies me beyond belief. Are they below me? No, they're not here. There are no ghost leviathans ever. And I'm so far out into the void... Like, do they stop chasing you after a while? Is that it? I thought they would always hound you. I wish there was, like, some other Leviathan you would find if you went far enough. I wish that was a thing. Alright, we're gonna lose oxygen really soon. And there's still no ghost Leviathans. Horrible. Nothing. 
If I see like some strange Leviathan just before I die, I will be very pissed off. Should die any second now. Oh, we're done. <laughs> it's too late to swim to the surface. I am nearly a thousand meters down. Ah, losing vision. There we go. Okay, so that was my um, At World's End challenge. This was not nearly as fun as I thought it was going to be. This is quite boring, actually. <laughs> I might think of some more challenges to do. Uh, keep the coffee hot. As always, finish the fight. Make sure you give them hell chill. And uh, if you see the Ghost Leviathans, tell them I'm waiting. Bye, guys.